guys welcome back to my channel welcome back to Vito's garage if you're new to the channel welcome to my channel I post new car videos every week so don't forget to subscribe and like this video and also don't forget to check out my playlists I have so many car videos and stuff you will not believe so uh, in this video actually I really wanted to go and show you this amazing W124 Mercedes because in supposedly in three days we're actually leaving Japan we're going back to United States so just so I don't miss that opportunity I'm gonna go ahead and show you this amazing W124 wagon that I saw here in Japan it's just beautiful you won't believe it but yeah like I said stay tuned and check out my other videos and I post new videos every week so there's gonna be always a lot of cool content so yeah stay tuned guys This is a beauty guys I love W124s guys please let me know what do you guys think about this car uh, leave your comments down below and like and share this video please guys this is such a beautiful car this is an E320 W124 chassis Mercedes uh, this looks like uh, it's a facelift so probably 94 or 95 uh, year made but it's so beautiful and it's uh i looked at the cluster it's got like around 187,000 kilometers so it's pretty much nothing and what's what's really cool about this car is actually somebody did like a wide body on it a uh, wide body kit so i don't think it's factory but uh this is pretty cool actually so the tires and wheels that it has on right now are winter set is a winter set so uh, probably they use a different uh, tire wheel set during the summer uh, but other than that uh, car is immaculate guys look at this white body guys and this car is so clean literally there's zero rust on this car it's amazing I love this car well now I really want a W124 in my life <laughs> See how this this works the car obsession and everything it's like drugs you look at something you really want to try it and once you try it you never go back guys so i just found out actually uh that this car belongs to one of the japanese guys uh i was not able to talk to him but i was able to talk to the colleague of uh this japanese owner and uh you know they told me that i can actually you know go ahead and take pictures or whatever videos and stuff but what i'm gonna do i'm gonna like always leave a note under the windshield wiper and uh that way maybe i can actually talk to the owner uh, somehow because we literally we have like three days left until uh i leave back to the united states so uh, i really wanted to show you this guy this car and uh you know let me know how what do you guys think about it but it's pretty awesome really like it and uh, you know it looks like they added the white body uh to this car uh, but it looks amazing i'm sure if you put different wheels some monoblocks on it 
during the summertime it's gonna look just amazing but yeah this the, the car is really beautiful and uh it actually the front end reminds me of uh you know uh e500 uh big wolf um a brother of this wagon the sedan uh but still i mean i really love the bumpers and everything on it and uh you know the wide body actually looks great and everything was if, it, if i'm pretty sure the wide body was done on this car uh before uh so it's not like a factory thing but it was done it was done in a you know using a great quality stuff and uh it was done with love so this car looks great and i really love the interior of this car it's uh, like a really bright interior cream color I really like it everything is so nice about it and uh, who knows I mean this person works here and uh, you know I really want to leave my contact information and uh, meet up with this guy maybe next year if I ever come here we can actually like you know make a car review or something on it I mean that would be dope make a test drive but yeah this car as you can see it even has a third brake light um, rear windshield wiper everything's pretty much original on this car other than that and uh, if it says e320 it's probably gonna have a m104 engine if it's something else then uh, it could be something else uh, maybe it's like a sleeper car uh, it's hard to say but I'm pretty sure it's got m104 inline 6 engine which is also really reliable I really like that uh, but yeah other than that I really love this car it's beautiful let me know your comments down below um and don't forget to like the video and subscribe for more i mean i post new videos every week uh new car content um so yeah should be a lot of fun i also love the windshield wipers i'm sorry not the windshield wipers but the headlight wipers it looks so old school Yeah guys, so it's a beautiful car and it also has a rear view camera but that was added on. Of course it's not factory but still it looks awesome. And I like it when they install uh, rear view cameras in the places where you can barely see them which is good because some people actually they put them somewhere like right here or something like that which doesn't look good at all. Uh, but this person, I mean they, they have their brains uh, and I know it doesn't look ghetto if they add something to the car which is awesome i really like it yeah, yeah guys so i really wanted to say big respect to japanese people because they really know how to take care of things and how to take care of cars and being here in japan i mean i really seen a lot and it's amazing i mean i've seen all these amazing beautiful cars and they're all well taken care of they have low miles and all that stuff but it's really amazing i really like seeing these amazing cars in shapes like that and when, whenever people love them and take care of them and that's what Japanese people do I haven't seen any other country in the world that would actually do that I mean it's insane and I just really wanted to say a big thank you to all these Japanese people and amazing owners that really love their car and appreciate what they have it's just amazing so before I leave I'm gonna actually write a note right now I'm gonna leave it under the windshield wiper and we're gonna be good to go hopefully I'll meet this person sometime in the future and we can talk more about this car all right guys so i just wrote a note i'm gonna leave it under the windshield wipers uh under under the windshield wiper there's only one uh and yeah we'll see hopefully this person contacts me uh i would really love to talk to him about this car it would be great
right guys that's it for this video thank you so much for watching don't forget to subscribe like the video and check out my playlists and recent videos i post new videos every week thank you so much for everything and uh i'll see you in the next one take care oh and i forgot das beste oder nichts